What's up guys? Haven't made a tutorial in a while, but today we're going to be doing Wolfman by the Front Bottoms. This tune was requested by Matthew Hayes, so thank you Matthew. But today we're not going to be learning it on the electric. We're going to do it on the acoustic, but if you want me to do a tutorial on the electric, get this video to 50 likes and then I will make that happen. So let's switch over to the acoustic. Sweet, let's come in close now. Nobody gonna hold me down, down. Think I'm gonna go away for a little while. Nobody gonna hold me down. I think I'm gonna go away. I'll teach you the intro on the electric because uh, you might want to play that part and then sing along or whatever you're doing in the acoustic. But uh, after that, if you're playing acoustic, you're probably gonna want to just hold down the groove. So, like I said, 50 likes for the electric, and I'll get that tutorial up here. But um, yeah, so I'll play it one more time just to let you guys hear it on the acoustic. So it starts in the 10th fret E string, then 8th fret E, then 10th fret B, so all together. Then you go to the 8th fret E again, then back to the 10th fret E, no, sorry, 10th fret B. So, so far you have Then you're going to hit the 10th fret B one more time and then go back to the 8th fret E. So all together that is real slow. One more time. After that, you're going to do the 10th fret B again, then 8th fret E, then the 12th fret E, then 8th fret E again. So all together that is... Then down to the 6th fret B, then 8th fret E, then 6th fret B again, 6th fret B again, so what you have is then 8th fret E again. So what we have all so far, real slow, is Then you're going to do 6th fret B again, then 5th fret E, 6th fret E, then 5th fret E again. So, then 8th fret B, 10th fret B, 8th fret B twice again and then 10th fret B. So those two parts together are then 8th fret B again 10th fret B 8th fret E then 10th fret E and then 7th fret G and you can leave that uh, 10th fret E ringing out too, so. So the entire thing, pretty slow, is this.
So that's the intro. While the electric guitar is doing that in the intro, the acoustic guitar underneath is doing this. So that is fifth fret A, third fret D, fifth fret A again, and then third fret D. So the rhythm of that is. Then you're gonna do double third fret D, seventh fret D, or you could do the second fret G. If you don't wanna make that stretch, you could do then back down to the third fret D. So together what we have is. Then you're gonna go first fret A, which is a B flat. Then back to your third fret D. Back to your first fret A. Then back to your third fret D. Then you're going to do your 2nd fret G or your 7th fret D, whatever you prefer. I'll do the 3rd or 2nd fret G just for example purposes right now. You're going to then do 2nd fret G, then 3rd fret D, 2nd fret G again, and then 3rd fret D. So that is... time. Then you're going to go to a C, which is 3rd fret A, 3rd fret D again, back to 3rd fret A, and then 3rd fret D again. So. Then you're going to go to 5th fret A, then 3rd fret D, you're gonna do that a little faster, so like, then fifth fret low E, then third fret D again. So that little part together is. Then you're gonna do your first fret A, your B flat again, then your third fret D again, and then first fret B again, third fret D. And then you're gonna do that twice, so. Kind of a little different the second time, but you're keeping those notes, that's what it is. So, all together, what you have is this, real slow. on that note into the singing in the verse. So right here I have a little index card which I can put a picture of on the screen if you guys want to screenshot that. You can have the notes, basically the root notes of all the parts of the song. So the intro is on there, it's just the root notes though, not like the tab of uh, all this part. It's just the roots. But uh, I'm going to look at that for the rest of this. The verse, then the first half of the first verse is silent. It's just the bass going along with it, so it'll just be singing. But um, you could technically play what I'm about to teach you on that part if you're singing this by yourself. So I'll play what it is right now. What that is, is a D power chord, which is 5th fret A, 7th fret D. Then you're going to go to an F power chord, which is 8th um, fret A, 10th fret D. 
So what you have so far is you're going to hit both three times. So. Actually four times the last one. Then you're going to go down to a B flat, which is first fret A, third fret D. Then you're going to go back to your F, your 8th fret A, 10th fret D. So all together you have... Then you're going to go to a C, which is 3rd fret A, 5th fret D. Then you're going to go to a D again, 5th uh, fret A, 7th fret D back down to your B flat, which is 1st fret A, 3rd fret D. So the chords for that all together real slow is So the chorus part picks up speed a little bit in the picking. It sounds like this. So that is a B flat power chord, which is 1st fret A, 3rd fret D. Then a C, kind of in between these two chords. You're going to do a C, which is 3rd fret A, 5th fret D. And that's going to just be one note, pretty much. So it's like... Then you go into your D, which is 5th fret A, 7th fret D. Then you're going to do one note again on an F, which is... 8th fret A, 10th fret D, then back down to your B flat, and you're going to do that same first half again, but you're going to go up to the F on the second time sooner. Instead of just doing it once, you're going to go through halfway the time you're doing that D. So from the beginning of the chorus part, real slow, this is what it sounds like. So that's the chorus. After that, it just goes back into the exact same intro for the acoustic that I taught you before. That whole thing does the exact same part. And then after that, the verse is not the power chords for the first half. Instead of just silence though, it is just uh, basically palm muted and just picked. So it sounds kind of like. So what that is, is 5th fret A string, which is a D, then an F, which is 8th fret A, then 1st fret A, which is a B flat, then back to an F, 8th uh, fret A, then down to 3rd fret A, which is a C, 5th fret A, the D, then back down to 1st fret A, your B flat. And then the second time round, it does the same thing, just um, with power chords. So you're going to add your fifth and the two frets passed. So.
then you're you'll do your whole uh the chorus part again and then after that comes the bridge so the bridge goes to something entirely different i'll play it for you here Basically what that is, it's an A, which is open A, second fret D, and uh, in the beginning you're just pretty much doing all four, so it's all just, then you're going to go to your B flat power chord, which is a first fret A, third fret D, and then um, you're going to go to a D, which is fifth fret A, seventh fret D, and you're going to hold that for two bars, so. You're gonna play that twice, so all together it's. Then you're gonna start getting that skippy kind of rhythm in the uh, strumming hand again, and you're gonna do your, your A and B flat again, so it's. You're gonna go to an F, which is eighth fret A, tenth fret D. Then a C sharp, which is fourth fret A, sixth fret D. Sounds a little weird without the vocals, but that is what it's doing. Then C, which is third fret A, fifth fret D. Then you're gonna do a final two hits on your B flat, which is first fret A, third fret D. And that is the whole bridge. After that, the end pretty much just goes out on the chorus. So um, the rhythm of that and just what you're doing is. So you're basically just doing that a bunch of times. And then the final thing it does is a little half time ending. So it does that same chorus riff, just half time. So it's going like. And then it ends on the D on the second time. So that is the entire tune. I hope that tutorial helped you guys learn that song. I'm going to say it a third and final time. If you get this video to 50 likes, we will uh, get an electric version of this tutorial up on the tube. I know that's not a huge number, but that's just what we're shooting for to start with. Um, if you haven't been to the channel in a while, I actually just released my first album. It's called Sylvanus by Ross Owen, and I'd love if you guys listen to it. That would mean a lot. It's on Spotify, Google Play, iTunes, whatever you listen to you can get there i'll leave in the description my website's called rossone.com bring you wherever you need to go but like comment subscribe hope you enjoyed and i will see you guys next time mm -hmm.